Details tonight about that helicopter crash in Manatee County. All three on board rescued in the Gulf of Mexico and the pilot now in critical condition. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith explains how the government shutdown is already impacting this investigation and the call for change to prevent another crash from happening again. The helicopter hovering 10 to 15 feet above the Gulf, photographing a boat below about one mile off the coast of Anna Maria Island. And I watched it today and I said, you know, at any time that helicopter could come down, you know, right here on top of us. Kathy Fannin, a longtime Manatee County boat captain, took video of a helicopter in the same area about a half hour before the crash. She believes low flying choppers are dangerous and happening too often. Just to have helicopters flying and buzzing the top of you right in the middle of the intercoastal, it's, it's just really unsafe. Something went wrong with this helicopter hovering, circling over the boat that they were videoing, taking pictures of. The single rotor aircraft is registered to Sarasota Helicopter Services. Tonight, no one answered our call to the listed number. Manatee County detectives are investigating the crash, an incident typically handled by the feds. But right now, with the government shutdown going on, we're doing what we can on the ground here to uh, to try to get some answers. The sheriff's office has reached out to the FAA and NTSB, but they say it's unknown when the feds will step in. In Manatee County, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.